Hi guys, today is the 10th of January 2020 at 30 minutes past 4 in the afternoon over here in the UK. I started off this video I'm looking at this lady here thinking that she might be Oprah, uh, obviously as we've looked at that possible interpretation before and you know the possibility of her jumping into the race and obviously I was looking at her, her hair as a reference to when that might be and obviously we've got the number 23 um, over here but putting um, that aside when I started looking at the hair more closely, I started seeing um, a bit more, not just the number 23, excuse my fat fingers on the screen, um, but the third one is not even a 2, it uh, to me looks like the outline of a snake tail raised up, so just sitting there like that, remove that so you guys can see that a little bit clearer without the markings across, so you see that. 23 and then you've got the snake there with the tail raised up um, but it's not just that there's also more and uh, I noticed it when I was looking at the different lighting um, within the hair itself so what I could see then was the number two I'll do that again I wonder if I can get this in or it would be great if I could Oh yeah, let me try it anyway. Number two, number three. So potential for the number twenty-three, but then the number six, and then I'm not gonna do the last marking because it will just mess it up. Um, but hopefully you can see there. What's left is the letter J. So you got twenty-three, six. Excuse me. Twenty-three, six, and the letter J. Now I'm thinking January twenty-third. And I was thinking, how does the 6 become involved? Maybe the 6 is a 9, I'm not too sure. Obviously you've got the 6 and 3 next to each other, which could give you a 666 reference. Um, however, I think that um, it could possibly be an interpretation for the letter F. Um, the reason I say that is because if you look at the number 6 there, it's darker than the 23 and the letter J. So that could be an interpretation to look at it as letters. Um, and since this code is right next to the alphabet as well um, given us that indication of letters it may be that we need to change it to a letter which is F so I looked it up and uh, Friday um, is not um, January 23rd January 23rd is a Thursday however if I use a slightly different calendar actually let me come come back to that First of all, January 23rd, with that J23 reference in the hair, um, I discovered that the Doomsday Clock will have an announcement on January 23rd. And when I was thinking of that, I thought, what's the likelihood that that announcement is going to be... Turn the volume down. Obviously, you can see the 23rd reference there. We all know about that. Um, and then the doomsday clock possibly at 12 o'clock obviously I think this also referenced Big Ben but the fact that they're having a doomsday clock announcement on the 23rd and the doomsday clock last I checked was something like 2 minutes to midnight with everything else that's going on in the world at the moment it could possibly be the announcement where they announce that it's midnight on the doomsday clock and obviously you've got the tsunami in the background references to submarines lights going out um, in this scene as it you know develops we've got the whole winter scene and everything else so there's a lot of things um, going on however January 23rd seems a bit obvious and as I said in connection with uh, the code from this lady's hair with the 23 the 6 and the J the 6 potentially being the letter F um, I looked at it instead on the lunar calendar and what I found was that January the 17th is the 23rd lunar day in the 12th lunar month so that's the 1223 reference that I've talked about a lot as well LT3 um, so I think that may may possibly come into play um, instead of it actually being on the 23rd using the 23rd lunar day which is the 17th of January and when I thought of that 
there's something that has been nagging me for many months um, in association with a song by Drake uh, called God's Plan. Some of you will be aware of it. Um, I've got the volume turned down. The, the numbers in the beginning obviously you know interesting a lot of people look to that nine nine and six upside down obviously you could translate that to six 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 but my interest came uh, a little bit later in the video try not to play much of it because copyright obviously is this up here it's right in the beginning of the video when I saw it um, when it was released the numbers stuck with me and uh, you know looked at things like the 1st of July, possibly 11 o'clock if the 23 is a reference to time. Um, but now, within the last you know, year of watch, coming up to the end of the year of the pig, the last 17, 23 um, potentially comes up, with the 17 being a reference to January, and the 23 being a reference to the lunar day, the same day, just reference it, referenced on different calendars. And obviously the video is called God's Plan, cross in the in the same scene there's a lot of um possible underlying subliminal messages that could be conveyed in this video with all that said i think that's my warning january 17th the 23rd lunar day keep an eye out i'm not sure exactly um what for if I look at the interpretations, if I look at the interpretations that have been given from the images, the 17th of January would suggest. Well, obviously, there's quite a few things: blackout connection, possible volcano eruption, or attack on the mountain in Iran where the uranium facility is housed. Um, Obviously, metaphorical house on fire, real house is on fire. There's Australia, there's California, there's the White House, the Capitol building. If it's a boat on fire, you know, a couple of USS aircraft carriers we've got on watch. Um, also, it's a nuclear rocket, so potential for a nuclear test or a real nuclear launch. SLBM, ICBM, missiles, we've seen a lot of that over the last couple of days. Um, obviously still the P-tape rumour or some sort of connection with a cult uh, death connection, New Year's connection the USS Abraham Lincoln connection UK connection as well submarine hiding the gun so yeah and obviously we've got the Psalm 23 reference with the doomsday clock the tsunami would be in the background in this scene the B-2 bombers LTN London Transport Network, London, Tokyo, New York, London, Israel, New York, so many different references um, for all these um, images. I'll work on some of these interpretations over the next couple of days, obviously. You guys, have a good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and may the Heavenly Father bless you.